Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Rebecca Rice and I teach family photographers to gain a life of freedom through a thriving photography business. In today's video, we're answering the question, is email marketing for photographers dead? Let's dive in. Go ahead and hit that like button if you haven't already so that other photographers like you can find this video easier and hit the subscribe button so that you get notified every week when new videos go live. Before we dive into all things email marketing, I wanted to let you know about a brand new free class we have just for you guys and I'm super excited about it. This class is the six steps to doubling your photography revenue this year. Now in this class, I walk you through what you need to do to get past just booking from your pretty pictures because here's the deal. Your work may be beautiful, but pretty pictures will only get you so far. So if you're wanting to actually increase your bookings and get in front of more people and finally be seen and truly double your revenue this year, this class is for you. And like I said, it's completely free. So it's linked here in the description. Go check that out. So let's talk email marketing. A big question that I get a lot from photographers is, is email marketing dead? Does it even work for photographers? What's the point? And I get it. That's a super valid question because oftentimes email marketing is seen more so in like the digital product space and less in a service-based business like photography. But after years of being in this industry and really um, like testing out lots of different marketing strategies and things like that, what I can tell you is for one, email marketing is not dead. If anything, it is more alive and well today than it ever has been. And there are several reasons that I think every photographer should be utilizing email marketing and have an email list um, in your business. And I'm going to walk you through those reasons. The first thing is that it's the fastest way to reach your warmest leads. It's the people that know you, they like you, they trust you, have given their email address to you, and really want to be notified when you are booking new things. They want to stay in the know, in the know of what's going on in your business and, you know, if you're running specials or things like that. These people are ready to book with you they just need the opportunity presented to them. And so if you want the fastest way to be able to reach those people, here's a hint, social media is not the way because odds are those people are not seeing the majority of your posts just because of the algorithms. And so with your email list, you are guaranteed to drop into their inbox every single time. And it's the fastest way to book the people that are already ready to book a session with you. It's also a great way to nurture people really, really well that maybe somebody joins your email list, they like you, they are kind of familiar with you, but really wanna to get to know you a little bit. They're not quite ready to jump into a photo session just yet. It gives you the opportunity to then nurture them so that when it does come time for them to get a photo session done, you are the top of mind and have already served them really well before you know, they ever book with you. And so there's a lot of things that you can send them to nurture them. And I'm going to go through that in actually my next video. Um, so stay tuned for that. But um, there's a lot of opportunity that you have to be able to get people ready to book a session with you. And your email list is the best way to be able to nurture people in that way. The next thing about email marketing is you own your email list. It's yours. Nobody can take it from you. You are guaranteed to drop into the inbox of anybody that has given you their email address. And you can't say the same for something like social media. You do not own your followers. Social media, we know the platforms change dramatically. Algorithms and, you know, so many things come into play and anything can happen, right? Anybody remember MySpace? It was huge. It was a thing. And then it just wasn't. And so you never know what's going to happen with social media. So you don't want to put all of your eggs in the social media basket when it comes to your marketing. You want to have a variety of different marketing pieces so that you can, you know, evenly distribute where you're putting your energy. And email marketing is one of those things that is of high value because you own it. Like I said, you're guaranteed to drop into their inbox. 
whether they open it or read your email, you know, that's up for question. But what I can tell you is they're seeing your email. You are staying top of mind. I can't tell you how many email lists I'm a part of, their newsletter. I don't open every single one. I don't read every single one. But when, you know, it comes time, let's say my realtors, for example, when it comes time to buy in a house, my realtors who send me constant emails just to keep me up to date and I get newsletters, they're the ones I'm thinking of. Or when a friend of mine is buying a house, who am I sending them to? My realtor. The same goes with photography, that as long as you're staying top of mind in people's inbox, then when it's time for them to book a photo session or their friends are looking for a photographer, who are they going to refer them to? you because you are top of mind in their inbox. And so even if they don't open all of your emails, I promise you they're seeing them. And that's the value of owning your email list is you are guaranteed to drop into their inbox anytime you send a message. That's super valuable. So if you have not started an email list, friends, now is the time. Don't wait. I promise you there are so many ways that you can do that. If you watch my free uh, class, the one that I said, the six steps to doubling your photography revenue linked in the description, I will walk you through some of those things of how to actually go about growing your email list because it's not too late. But what I can tell you is if you don't start today, six months from now, you're going to be looking back and being like, man, I wish I would have started my email list. So friends, start it today. I guarantee you, you will not be sorry. You're going to be so thankful that you started because really the only place you can go from here is up if you don't have an email list yet. So take the time, go ahead and start one. My favorite email platform is Flowdesk. It's like the Canva of email systems. I do have a discount code linked in this description if you want to check that out. Um, But get that email list started because it is highly effective in booking those warmest leads, nurturing people, and getting people from a place where they're not so sure to they're super ready to book a session with you. So I hope this video was helpful for you. If you have any questions about email marketing, all the things, go ahead and comment them below. I'd love to come through and answer those and um, go watch that free class that I mentioned. It's linked in the description of this video. I know it's going to be so helpful for you. So with that, I'll go ahead and close and I'll see you back next week for another awesome video. Bye guys.